Hey, hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Double D's Non-Sports Car Reviews For me and you Oh, give me a thumbs up If you do If you don't Anyways We want to keep this Get this off on a boom boom Since, you know, these do take a while And, um Let's see what card set we got today. Again, this one I also got from Rainbow Collectibles. Great place, great guys. Not sponsors. I don't do sponsors. But, still check out their website. You know, they're pretty cool. Tell them Double D sent you. And, here we go. What's this one? This one is Rowena set. Ooh, I like Rowena. I don't know if it's a complete set, as usual. But, her art is pretty dang good. She does a lot of book covers and things like that. Now this set is from 1993, Rowena Morell. There are 90 cards in the set, including the checklist. I do not have any of the holograms, but that's that. Y'all know the format of this. I'm going to look at the front card, maybe make a comment. We'll look at the back, put in the thing, and move on. Let's see. Oh, that's not for children. Children should not be looking at these. If you're under 18, please leave. I mean, they're not, not dirty cards. But they're, some people might not want their kids looking at paintings of certain things. You should cruise. But hey, respect your parents. Unless they're dicks. But still respect them. Okay, see, like this one here. Yeah. That's cool, though. I like that artwork. Now, you can always tell a good artist by how they draw hands and feet. I mean, if I see one here, I'll show you. But... It's nice. I like that. You can tell when somebody uses a live model as opposed to just drawing from the top of their head. Like this model looks like the same one as that one. I have some of Rowena's art books. Because I just, I, like I said, I enjoy her art. But his, I don't even know if it is a woman. Maybe it's a man. I don't know. I'm not sure how this card is supposed to be set anyway. I'm guessing like that. One thing I always like about these artwork is the uh, very strong females in them. Because women make badass warriors too. I hate when things get stereotypical. One thing I didn't notice about these cards, they have very little actual text on them. Which is cool, makes flipping them quicker. Don't think that dude looked behind him yet. This looks familiar. This is from a book cover. I know that much. What's the book? I want to say the Blue Adapt for by Piers Anthony. Let's find out. What's it from? It doesn't say. I'm telling you, that looks just like the cover art from the Blue Adapt by Piers Anthony. I could be wrong on that, though. Let me know down in the comments below, because I'm actually not going to look that up. Beautiful P 
pieces. That right there looks almost like Flash Gordon. Doesn't say what it is. Let's Looks almost Romanesque. Modern woman put back in there. Oh, with the uniform. Okay. Vampires, I'm guessing. Doesn't say. Oh, haunted house on top. Well, I should didn't even notice that thing written on top. Not very pierogi. Pagoda. Ah, yeah, my memory isn't that good. Is this supposed to be Icarus or oh, who's the one who gave fire to man? Not Pandora. Yeah, I don't remember. It's nice. Porns are hardcore. What movie is that from? Aztec. Feel free to leave a comment below if you can figure out where that movie where Yit Corns are hardcore came from. Yes, I do know. It's a good movie. This be Zeus. Jupiter. Uh, Roman. The Greeks are better. That's got to be Icarus. Or maybe uh, Cupid. Guardian Angel. No. Nope. You ever read the description of angels in the Bible? They're freaking scary things. Oh, I know this one too. This is definitely a book cover. Oh. I won't say tangled skin, but wood nymph. I know that's a book cover to something I've read. I just don't know what. fast I know I'm trying to get through these things quicker well that's just freaking scary multiple dragons I'm guessing the nightmare yeah don't look behind you never look behind you Something might not be there, but then again, something might. That's gross. Not too many eyeballs. Hmm. If you enjoy this sort of art, yeah, check out some, like some old books. Be surprised on their cover art. What famous artists that did the covers? Midas Faust That's a tall dude Okay, this is from For Love of Evil by Piers Anthony and the Incantations of Immortality. Uh -huh. That's supposed to be the devil. Uh -huh. I remembered one. That is a good series. I recommend the Incantations of Immortality. You gotta start with the first one, which I think is Baron and Baron and Hourglass are on no on a pale horse. The seven incantations are, you know, death, 
time, um, good, evil, that sort of thing. I still remember a quote, love of evil. Um, the ink, good shall kiss evil, and the incarnation so applaud. Read the books, they're good. I didn't know she drew the cover. That was sort of like an album cover. Warriors of the Sky. Let's see now. That's a, we're up to card 72. Oh, okay. This is from the last book. No, is it? I think it's the last book in the uh, Incarnations of Immortality because this is God. The three different aspects. You. It's too hard to explain. You have to read the entire set to understand it. But it's it's a good book series. I can't remember the title of the last one. If you enjoy, well, anybody would enjoy Piers Anthony. His books are just awesome as all get out. Love his work. His Zanath. I never know how it's pronounced. X A N T H. Zanath. Zanath. That series of books is just fun to read. Okay, that's ugly. Almost looks like a trollic, but it's not. Trollgadite. Card number 86. Should I be reading out the card numbers as I'm doing this? Let me know down in the comments if you think that's something I should be doing. And why not, you know, hit that like button. Give me a thumbs up. Are you enjoying these series? I will continue doing them because I have a lot of non-sports cards and I love showing them, but, you know, still. Plus, it's good content. That dude looks like he has a major wedge. Uncomfortable. And the final card is, of course, the... I didn't realize I was already at the final card. But the... Um, checklist card. You can always tell a good card set because you don't realize how fast you've been looking through them. This Rowena set from... What is the date on this thing again? 1993. I liked it. I love her art style. I've seen it before. She does great book covers and uh, it's pretty cool. You should check out her work. You'll probably find it online if you, you know, Googled it. Though I do recommend buying her books because support the artist. 
And uh, that was it. Pretty cool. I like it. Better than the last set. Where did I put that? It's somewhere around here. Uh, here we go. Much better than this set. The what's it called? San Juan set. Now, I'm, only, I'm sure Boris and Sonia both made set. Anyways, she's one of the big fantasy artists. I rec If it is a female, I honestly don't know if Rowana is male or female. I don't care. The artwork speaks for itself. It's beautiful. Anyways, we hit 16 minutes. We don't want to be on this thing forever, and I'm pretty sure my memory on my phone is almost full. I'm going to have to get this stuff off. Put it on my computer. Got to get a memory card to transfer it all over. So much to do. Being broke really, really sucks. Too many of my pre-orders came in at the same time. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Maybe tell others. Spread the word. At the moment, we're at 59 subscribers. Cool. I must have been happy at 46. I just want to get... But I've had a recent boost, and... I want to thank all who you are subscribed. And uh, y'all have a nice night. I'll see you in the next video. And uh, Double D out. Like a round stone coyote boy. Doo.